So I'm Neil Stevens. I'm the uh, Vice President and General Manager of our global consumer business. I'm Jonathan Christensen. I run our platform business unit at Skype. It's all about video for Skype this year at CES. Uh, we announced uh, the acquisition of Quick. It's a really great uh, software company who do an amazing job around two-way video and asynchronous video sharing uh, into the cloud, into the social web. We acquired them today. Big news for us, they have some great partnerships with people like uh, Sprint in the US, T-Mobile. Uh, we also announced group video calling going live, uh, charged for $8.99 a month, which is a... Skype's one and only acquisition in five years. That's true. His was the first acquisition we ever made. This is second. The second Congratulations. One in history. Yeah, it's second in history, so uh, that's a big step for us. Uh, we had the iPhone launch just a few days ago, an incredible success. Uh, over 10 million downloads already, a million calls on day one, so very, very exciting for us. Uh, we just came out with the Verizon uh, LTE launch. They announced Skype right in the heart of the product, into the address book, into the network with hardware acceleration, so we're really excited about the Verizon relationship. So a lot of stuff going on. We also announced today that uh, Telegeography said we were 25% of the world's international calling minutes now. So one in four international calls happen through Skype now. So a lot of exciting news. Last year at CES we announced uh, Panasonic and Samsung on the TV set. Uh, this year we're adding Sony and Vizio. And in addition we're adding Panasonic uh, Blu-ray players with Skype embedded in them, so you don't have to you don't have to take out your television screen. You can uh, you can retrofit it with a box, uh, as well as a Sony Bravia um, uh, Blu-ray player that has Skype embedded in it as well. And those will be shipping later this year. Right, so the, the entire Skype experience is embedded uh, within the the embedded computer in the TV. Um, there's a camera, and this, there's one running right over there in the corner. Uh, there's a camera that goes right on top of the TV or wherever it's convenient to put it. Um, and from the remote control, the native remote control from the TV, you can just access Skype and start a call. And uh, typically it's three or four button clicks and you're in a call. Uh, your existing Skype account uh, works right there. It's, you know, it's, it's pretty seamless, actually. We haven't really started tracking that uh, metric yet. Um, we're kind of just getting going with this. Uh, I don't know if we're talking about the number of TVs no, that are yet. shipping. Not, yeah. Yeah, no, it's no. a huge number of yeah. TVs, though. Yeah. I mean, really, really a mass market thing. Um, between the Samsung leader in, in flat panel displays, Vizio leader in North America, I mean, these are the major players in, in the space. I mean, obviously Sony, I mean, huge, right? Uh, so, and, and they're shipping it across a wide uh, variety of, of SKUs. Uh, the Google thing is um, is interesting. It's warming up, um, and uh, we're we're kind of taking a, a wait and see of approach to that. You know what the developer program will look like, and, and uh, what the platform will look like as it evolves. A um, couple of interesting products out there today. I've got the Sony, you know, in my house. I've got the Logitech Review. I've got the camera, and I'm experimenting with it. Some real possibility there.